to say an absolute thank you to each and every single one of you who showed support for me today when I laid it all out on the line in front of you in regards to a little mishap and disrespect I felt was happening. The greatest thing about all of that that I could tell you is remember, I've always told you, we don't believe in drama on this channel. We work through things step by step and each and every single one of you that gave me that love and that support, I appreciate all of you because guess what? I remember back in the day when I started this channel with zero subs. I remember each day working to try to pick up a handful here or a handful there so I know exactly what the YouTube grind is. I'm humbled, I'm appreciative of every single day and every chance I get to get on this very stage before you. And for those that will listen to me and hear me out, because all I want to do is show that each step that we make and each way that we handle different things in life can make a difference. We as true crime diggers and researchers and lovers that want to help others out there not fall victim to these very types of crimes. That's why we fight for justice, not just for the ones that we lose or those that are hurt or those that just loss of life occurs. More importantly, we want to get better and move forward through the times into the future to where it doesn't happen even more. I used to be a man that was very chaotic emotionally. If I felt as though someone picked at me or disrespected me, I was ready to go. It didn't matter whether I was a small guy. None of that matters. For all of those that say, oh, he's five foot seven, he couldn't handle himself, I did the very best I could. I handled things inappropriately, and it landed me in the places to where I had to give up parts of my life. But also on top of that, I hurt others. So I made a pact with myself in the process that I'm still in today of bettering myself that I would focus in on the very key parts of my personality and myself that I knew led to those ways of acting. And I wanted to work on them and better them so that I didn't continue to hurt others. I did not disrespect them based off of my actions or the way I allowed my mind to push me into scenarios that would either defraud them, take from them, or hurt one of their loved ones. If more people could focus on improving those very scenarios in their life because they also feel that support, and that help from the outside places they never thought they would get it, we could touch some of these individuals who are committing these horrific crimes before it actually happens. We could catch the kids that are thinking about running away or trying their first ever narcotic or alcohol attempt into their bodies and we could sue them and allow them to go back to the freedom of their mind and emotions to live life day by day knowing that somebody cares. I'm glad I had a wife that sat me down this morning when I was trying to figure my way, my wording to handle a situation that in the back of my mind I was upset and I was just torn in regards. I had other people helping me through their support as well. And you know what? I can very happily sit right here before you right now and state 
that I've spoken directly to the person I was engaged with in regards to this, and there is absolutely zero drama. We've talked. We laid out how we felt. We discussed that. We had a good conversation for a good long hour on the phone. Guess what? It's done. It's over. We're moving forward. And we're doing it in a good, positive way. One foot in front of the other will lead us to better in our channels as we move forward. We're both focused. Maybe not on the same thing. We don't do the same type of content. We don't talk about the same things. But you know what we do do? We talk like two grown men. And we ironed it out and we moved forward. I urge others that feel as though they've got an emotional chaotic hindrance between them and somebody else within the YouTube streets. Try that mentality. Do exactly that and iron it out and move forward. That way both of you could be successful in working within your built communities, your subscribers, and your members that matter. I don't mind mattering to me because they built me up from a zero to where I am today. And I'm so thankful and humbled by that. But at the end of the day, I'm not going to change who I am as a person. And I came onto this platform with a respect level for everybody around me. And I'm not going to let that shift or change. So those that reach out to say, Albert, don't ever change. Keep working through what you're doing. I hear your advice, I take it to heart, and I'm applying it each and every day. So thank you to all of you. Just a brief moment. We'll have another video coming very soon, but I had to stop because all of you are very important. Issue done, over, moving forward. Here we go. Have a great night.